And here we go. They reach the FA Cup fifth round for the first time in 13 years last season. Brentford, can they do it again here today? Loose into their own box, and Inacho finds Perez, and it's around the goal, and just stolen away. Desperate, but really important, if anything. Ratchet's got it away in the end. It very nearly 1-0 to Leicester in the opening 20 seconds. Opportunities limited this season, Pratt. A lovely ball, and it's across the far stick, and it is 1-0, and Inacho from the James Justin cross puts Leicester City ahead. They started so brightly, and after three minutes gone, they're 1-0 up. Yeah. Exciting days to be a Brentford fan, and especially to be a Leicester fan. And there's a, another foul. Morg was in the team, beaten in the quarter-final by, che by Chelsea a couple of years ago. They've gone near post. Another by Pratt. Ian Adger making the run between the centre-halves and got there. And tested the fingers there. And Daniels in the Brentford goal. Cocho. Sam Burek better from the home side. And this match Ruslav with the championship team. Fifth in the championship. Cross into the box. Cleared away. Sam Burek sets it up. And Marcondes! Scored a terrific goal to win the third round tie against Stoke. Off target there. It's good play from Ruslan. He's been under so much pressure from a defensive point of view. Finally gets a yard. That lovely little touch on the edge of the box. And Mercondes just couldn't quite get his foot around it. It's a decent enough strike. And half the stadium thought he hit the back of the net. Unfortunately for Brentford, he hit the side netting, but that'll give them some confidence. Zamburek. Allowed to go inside. Nice. You had a look, look up there, Zamburek, but there's nothing on. Made sense to take on the shot. And to go to your point, Jonathan, about Leicester, I think that's the beauty about what Brendan Rodgers has done here. You know, he's he's got a great squad of players and they're all hungry to impress. Terrific man manager. He's been in here. Good turn by Curtis Olyu. And then wide, another Turkish under 21 international. Listen to the noise. Yeah. They're starting to find a few gaps now. Sometimes it can take you a while to figure out where those spaces are when you come up against such a good team. But Turfusoglu this time, only a couple of yards away from finding the far corner. But that's much better. Scored five for Spider Rotterdam this season before moving for three million pounds. He's got to be careful of things like that. Which gave it away. Here's all Brighton. Got the shot away. Close to two. And not involved today. Here's Thompson. Allowed to come a long, long way and go for goal. And it crept beyond the fingers of Danny Ward. Did it or did he get a touch on it? It's a corner. It took him a while to make his mind up about what he wanted to do, and I think in the end, he just thought, let me have a go. He didn't catch it really well. Ward just gets a fingertip to it. Strong run here from deep position by Inacha. It's a lovely ball to Jose Perez. Is this too? Parry, good save by Daniels. Important moment in the tie. That's a poor clearance away. Oh, Brighton's onto it. Good goalkeeping and then Messi defending. Taken very quickly, and the cross into the middle created danger away by Fuchs. Again, good work by Zamburek. In comes a second ball, it's off the post wow. and squirted away by Fuchs. So close, Brentford to an equaliser. You know, he's been brilliant today, Christian Fuchs. So, at the passing on one end, really quick free kick uh, throwing by Brentford. He clears the first one, switched on to that scenario. And look at the position, gets himself in. Right in front of Valencia, I think it is, to make sure that his body is between himself and the ball to clear it. I don't know whether it went clean through from this man, Macondes, or whether it just flicked off Solincho in the middle onto the post.
Brentford on top of this moment as they seek the equaliser. High to the far stick, Ratchich comes in and out by Demare Gret. And Chowdhury. Luisa Perez. Now thrust further forward and looks to bring in James Justin. Good pressure from the right fullback. And the cross, I think he, I think he might have been going for goal. Was uh, headed. Macondes again. Both have played well. It's a good ball, looking for the far post and boom up. There was a touch. There was a touch by Christian Fuchs. Now he can't believe it. Well, it's a strange one because the official on the far side agreed with Christian Fuchs that he didn't touch it. I didn't see a touch there. And the referee seemed to take an age to make a decision. He's closer, maybe he heard something, but... Sharp man, she Ellis kept the flag down, didn't she? She did, indeed. McCondes with the corner. Decent delivery, and her time spectacularly and very nearly 1-1. Rakitic it was. So close to equalising. Good goalkeeping. It's just a brilliant technical volley. Very difficult to execute, it's dropping quick, gets good contact on it. He'd just be disappointed he couldn't find a corner. It's a great save from Ward. Really good goalkeeping, Danny Ward. They've hit the post and they forced a very good save in this second half. They try and force this equaliser. McCondes with the corner kick, Ratchich is in there again. Josh De Silva, Henry. And Bumo, flag up! Flag up! What a very accomplished finish, by the way, but the flag was up. What an entrance that would have been. So look at this Leicester defensive line. They get out, and they get out quick to the edge of the 18-yard box, and that's the beauty of doing that. Because when it comes back in, you're leaving them offside.